Hey everybody, the Bond guys back. Welcome to part 15 of Let's Play Pokemon White 2. Alright, I spent like a good amount of time trying to level up the team. So as you can see, they're a little bit stronger. And by a little bit, I mean a lot stronger than they were since the previous episode. And I figured I'd take that approach. Honestly, before I do that, let's go get some more Ultra Balls. Because I think you guys know what's coming. There was quite a few trainers we didn't beat over in Route 13. I'm not worried about that. What I am worried about is that legendary Cabalion just standing there waiting for me to make the challenge. And that's exactly what I'm going to do. Might as well see if there's any items over here that I missed. Oh, what's this? Probably another Ardino, isn't it? Well, I could use the extra pick-me-up in experience, so... Hook me up with some of that right now. Also, thanks to my uh, level, her finally got Giga Drain instead of Mega Drain. That'll make things go a little bit better. Let's go see what that item is. Got a Max Ether for my troubles. There's another item over there. And a Ranger I didn't beat. The first trainer of this episode had to be a freaking triple battle, didn't it? Larvesta, Flareon, and Vibrava. This is, uh, gonna be a wild one. Uh, Leaf Blade could work okay on Vibrava. A uh, Bone Rush on Flareon. And I'm thinking Spark on Flareon, too. I like to get rid of that one as fast as possible. Well, it's a good thing I had two attacks on Flareon. That was enough to take it out. Screech? You got Screech now? I honestly find it more reliable than Supersonic. We'll go with Screech then. All those moves and you decided to go with String Shot, huh? Honestly, it doesn't matter what you do. Can't reach. Can't reach! It's out. coming together as one. What great teamwork that was. <laughs> well, you didn't get to do squat. <coughs> All that for a citrus berry. In a triple battle, your Pokemon have more than triple the power. It's a true test of a trainer's skill. One step. One step and I already got in a battle. That's a Tangela, no less. Enough of that. That was all that for a blue shard, too. Are you kidding me? This is a, a little atrocious for an encounter rate. Repels have really spoiled me. Oh, the item's down there. Oh my freaking Christ. I don't want to fight. I need to conserve my strength for the Cabalion. There. Finally. I don't care if this a pearl. Let's 
So yeah, you would have to go through that grass if you didn't have cut. Which thankfully I do. What do I want to start with? I think I want to start with Maggie and just screech this legendary down. Garbra! It's probably gonna have fighting moves, so Steel is gonna be in trouble. Level 45, eh? You know what? Frig it, we're not gonna worry about the quick ball. He was Iron Head, why would you do that? He's gonna keep using Helping Hand, what's wrong with you? Oh, that was perfect! One spark, already down to red. Maybe I should've bought more Ultra Balls. Okay, here's the plan. If Maggie faints... And chances are it may not for several more turns. Then I'll switch to Teeth and use False Swipe. I go through a lot of effort for a Pokemon, I'm just gonna leave in the box for the entirety of the playthrough. Yeah, keep using Retaliate. No, it's too bad it only gets to use it five times. Having moves with low PP just can only mean you get into struggle territory faster. That's the part I'm worried about. I don't have many uh, moves that can inflict status ailments like sleep. Paralyze. I feel like I should always have a Pokemon that's ready to do that. Maybe train up a Pokemon that can learn Spore. Spore is like the best uh, slate move you can get. And also, I remember when I had Thunder Wave once. Burn through all my Ultra Balls, isn't it? Well, if I miss this chance, I can try to catch it again. But much later in the game. Get in the ball. Now stay in the ball. It's only using Iron Head, Retaliate, Helping Hand. And I think that's it. What's the other move? Is it Sacred Sword? I think it has Sacred Sword. Ooh, I'm not goofy. Teeth. I'm gonna hit it with false swipe at least once. Oh, now you use sacred sword. And I faint. All right, I know what I need to do. I need to bring in Tony to lower its attack. I don't think that's gonna make a difference, but it'll keep me alive longer. All I have are physical moves. Or like, attack moves.
Yeah, I might have to dedicate, a, like, a couple Pokemon just for catching legendaries. This ain't cutting it. Let's try the Luxury Ball for fun. You're gonna be like that, aren't ya? Seriously? You're whittled down to not almost nothing. You should be surrendering to me. And that you did! I knew you'd give in to peer pressure. The Iron Will Pokemon. It has a body and heart of steel. It worked with its allies to punish people when they hurt Pokemon. Okay, I got a name for you. Iron. Or Iron. Iron. A play on words. I forget it. You know, I'm not gonna go out of my way to, to deal with every single trainer in the game. If I miss items, I'll miss items. I can always come back to it later. I think right now I just wanna get closer to Opelucid City. You know, I should really sell some of my, uh, expensive stuff. Not gonna do it all at once, though. Excellent. Now we got a lot more Ultra Balls to make up for Cabalion. Oh, Cole's over here, too. He's just waiting right there. So I would've had to talk to him if I tried to leave. Anyway, there's a full heal. I don't have anything to do ever since I took a post here. Since nobody goes out at night, it's very peaceful. The big scary monster that comes out at night is a Pokemon, right? It must be a really scary Pokemon if everyone believes the legend and follows these rules. Welcome to Lacanosa Town. In this town, people live as methodically as clockwork from morning to night. If you live your life soaking up sunlight, you can sleep very well at night. What's up? Have you seen Team Plasma anywhere around here? I heard a rumor to that effect. Oh, look what you brought in, Cole. Oh, for crying out loud. This is troublesome indeed. My curious trainers. Perhaps I should satiate your curiosity somewhat. The reason I am still a part of Team Plasma is this. I want to know how the world will change. Listen. Pokemon are nature. Pokeballs are civilization. Humans who are used to civilization don't relinquish it easily. Of course, both nature and civilization are important. But what will happen to a world taken over by Team Plasma? People will be forced to throw out Pokeballs, a product of civilization. I want to know what that looks like, and I want to enjoy it. Shut your mouth! All I want is to get back a stolen Pokemon. Bonga, give me a hand. You ready? Just to let you know, you're about to feel my rage. Here, here. <laughs> Let's go. Alright, 
Golbat and Cry Cryogonal. Yeah, I think this uh, team is okay. I forgot that Maggie was the one in front, not Herb. So this works out for me. Why'd you target the Golbat? You're strong against ice. What are you doing? Alright, fine. I'll flash cannon cryogonal. Because that damn light screen, too. You're all over the place, man. I wonder your Embor fainted. Oh, Sneasel? Okay, that one's also weak against ice. I mean, weak against steel. I'll just use Magnet Bomb this time. And it's over for you. If I can hit you. Or not. I don't have to hit you. What a blunder to a main made in front of Zinzolan! Pressure I felt from you just now. What was that? What's with these two? I'm battling alongside Zinzolan. This shouldn't be happening. These trainers remind me of that one from two years ago. More important, we must continue our search. Like that scientist said, it might be an Opelucid city. We'll play with you again later. Get back here! Yeah, he's feisty as always. We need to heal. Well, oh, I guess we can finally head left again. Route 12. Oh, how convenient that you just be right there the very second I go that way. Travel the uneven road to hone yourself. You've got to train your guts. If I want to train my guts, I just eat Activia all day. Jeriel, if that's your real name. And I don't think we'll be having any of that. Freedom, it's your time. Ooh, that did a lot of damage still. Like, even after all gaining all these levels, I'm sometimes still one hit from dying. You can't win just with guts, that's the truth of it. A green shard. Oh, come on! Can't even leave that thin of a patch of grass either. That's a pincer, I already got a pincer. So I don't need you. You mean to tell me that did that little damage? What the hell? Did you give me no time to react to that. Rio and I are one of one mind. That's why you're gonna have to use two Pokemon against us. It's so fun to battle alongside Cleo. Oh, you'll stop having fun. I promise you that. Cleo and Rio. Oh, they both got Rosalia. I don't think it's gonna do much, but fine. Let's get a good feel for what their team is like first. Oh, never mind. We didn't need to switch after all. 
Wow, what a surprise! Wow, what a surprise! Jeez, I wonder how they got all that money. Bet you cheerleading doesn't usually pay that well. In any case, we can look around here. Oh, come on, it's Yancy again, isn't it? Who else would call me in an arbitrary spot that's not gated by anywhere? Nobody else does this. Okay, a timer ball over there, too. I see the double grass. Fine, I'll go in. Got an ultra ball for free. You know what? I'll fight you. You gotta have stamina. Burn the flames of life and never stop moving forward. This is something you just say to strangers all the time? Okay. Azra. Oh, you got a girder. Is that how you want it? Oh, it's setting up our fighting move, so I better start willing it down with paralysis lock, and it hits with dynamic punch. Bull shit. All right, Teeth, it's up to you. It's paralyzed, so you have a great chance. Oh my god! Two times in a row it connects. Fine, Tony, it's up to you now. What a load of crap. All right, Mianfu? Well, I guess I can stick around. Perfect. I'm out of stamina! Good. Okay, there's a peepee -pee up there. This item better be good, too. Yellow shard. Ah, uh, I might make use of it. Oh, I'm staying right on it. Max Repel. But what Pokemon are on Route 12? All of these. I still find a Dunsparce there, which I still don't have. That's kind of funny. I think on the other side of this is what, the village bridge? If I remember. I'm sorry, I ended up losing my uniform. How'd you do that? I'm Encino. My grandpa caught it for me. Tail slap is its specialty. I did my best to choose a Pokemon that was both cute and strong. Good for you. I tried to ask for directions, but it turned out I was talking to a Pokemon trainer. You need to be careful, too. Well, let me head for our Pokemon Center immediately. Not before grabbing a Carbos. That's right, you can find Pokemon out in this water as well. Ah, damn it! A high-level battling technique is art in its own way. Alright, go. What do you got? Sunflora. I think I can make this work. Well, that was a smart idea, wasn't it, Sunflora? Oh, 
calm mind. Um, but aren't all my moves physical? I mean, if I ever want to boost my special defense. You know what? Let's get rid of counter, because I hardly ever use it. Your strength cannot be put into words. And yet you tried. A big mushroom. Pretty sure this bridge does have a Pokemon Center. I need to make sure I'm on the uh, bridge itself to get there. Maybe it doesn't have a Pokemon Center, but instead has an actual house. Wait, wait! I've been waiting for this day. You're the 1,000 opponent. I've got a 999 win streak. Be my battle opponent. Wahaha! Even though you're just a fledgling, you'll still be my 1,000th win in a row. Alright, Stonewall. Okay, you have a Durant. Like, you're not Stonewall and your first Pokemon's not even Rock. What a wasted opportunity that was. Your ant is useless against me. You thought you had a chance. Oh, Lucario? I mean, we could do a mirror match, however... I need a little something Tony would be very awesome against for once. Ooh, that was a good dodge. That could have hurt a lot. Outrage? It's powerful! And, but it would get me confused. However, I think I can afford getting rid of Crunch. Ah, oh, how merciless. I've steadily extended my win streak for two years, and now it's over. But I have a strong will. I declare that I'll try again to have a 1,000 win streak. I won't battle you next time, though. You'll just break my streak. I only want to deal with people weaker than me. Maybe it's over this way? Maybe it's actually a house I gotta go to. How much somebody ever raised me like this? With three meals and a nap every day? Do it yourself. I wonder if better veteran Pokemon raise or train young Pokemon. Follow me, Ducklet! It is following you. Pay more attention, kid. Oh! You're a newcomer, aren't you? Then let's battle without saying a word. Are you ready? No. I'll come back. I'm totally hooked on village sandwiches. I come here every day to eat them. I guess I have to battle the chef to get one. I was happy to be able to eat with my Pokemon. Pokemon make the most adorable faces when they bite into sandwiches. Yeah, usually the ones that end up swallowing them without chewing. I'll be a stone cutter like my grandpa. I could get help from powerful Pokemon. Yeah, at least you're related to a stone cutter. If Team Plasma had tricked everyone into releasing all their Pokémon, it would have been impossible to build a bridge like this. People and Pokémon are inseparable. The relationship is not more or less than that, that's what I believe. My great-great-great-grandfather and his girder worked together and built this village bridge. Just the two of them. Nobody else helped. These are cowards. 
I just find it funny, there's a whole bunch of houses over there, but they're the only ones you cannot get in. Like, those houses, in particular, have no doors. What the hell? This house is empty. Why is that? A woman was living here with a group of Patrat. I wonder where they went. Seeing Watchy Watchog on TV reminds me of those Patrat. Um, okay. Not my problem though. What is my problem is that I'm kind of beat up. Oh, your Pokemon look pretty tired. Don't be shy. Take a nice long rest. Oh, thanks. I needed that. Both you and your Pokemon are healthy and energetic. If you get tired, please talk to me. I'll let you take a nice long rest. How kind of you. Well, I guess I can check out the rest of this place. Oh god, those were trainers too! My serve is 120 miles per hour. That's the kind of killer attack I'm about to show you. You're gonna hit me with a tennis ball instead of a Pokemon battle? Smash your Lizzie with a Whimsicott? Sarah, I'm about to smash you with my Pokemon. I have to make sure to clarify that, because it has a whole other meaning, otherwise. That was your good move, Gust. That was pointless. You're gonna smash me, huh? Oh, I wanted to continue to rally just a little bit longer. Well, maybe get good. You'll actually have a long one this time. Watch my furious tennis footwork. You get it now? We're really tough. Yeah, whatever you say, Amy. A ah, Lilligant. That kind of made sense you run into those two. All right, Freedom, take this one. Try not to get to yellow or red health on a single hit this time. Oh, no. Okay. Bryce is averted with that confusion. But, but I'm tough enough to go all day and all night. In tennis? Not for Pokemon, though. My favorite thing nowadays is to compete in the PWT, and yet, you're here. What else is waiting for me in this spot? Also, what is the Pokedex list for Village Bridge? Okay, it says all of them on the mainland were caught. What about in the water? So far, just these three have been seen. Alright, no sense to go without a repel while I'm in land. Weep, 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 weep! Huh? A rare candy. Okay, I remember. It was like that in Black and White 1 as well. Talk to certain people on Village Bridge, and there's more instruments. I forgot I no longer have a Pokemon with Surf with me. I have to shuffle the team. Oh wait, there's no box here! Ah, oh, damn. Oh, might as well use it now. So I can't get over to that island just yet. Let's get all this out of the way first. Another Ultra Ball. Let's try another trainer over here. 
Don't you ignore me. I just keep running around. I've got the whole field to myself. What do these NPCs ever do that's of value? Like, just running around the field in, like, a rhombus pattern? Why? What do you get out of it? Give me your energy juice. Thirsty. I know, I know, I shouldn't take it all for myself. There's nobody there with you. I'm sure they could go over there if they want. Singing gives life to my spirit. Will you listen to the voice of my spirit? I'll come back for that island soon enough. There's a blue shard. Um, no. Huh? Be, 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 be. Woo. Eek! I'm practicing! Get out! Practicing what? That was awkward. This must be where the basketball court is. How about this? This sound. Doesn't it get to your heart? Your mind? I like how you get all this music going as soon as you get in a fight it all changes. Fooling you fair and square. That's what we call a trick play. We're not playing basketball. Hoopster Nicholas. Magby, Magmar, and Magby. Oh, this is a triple battle for fuck's sake. All three of my team is weak against fire. Yeah, this is gonna be a disaster unless I switch. Oh, I definitely gotta switch you. You cannot stay. Maybe I'll body at least one or two of them. Without it being an issue. Got the Magmar at least. Oh, shit. Those two at Flamethrower. Oh my god, and they even got Flame Body too. It's all gone wrong. Though I have the advantage. How does that even happen? Go away. What the hoops? I was the one who was tricked. Okay, walk away so you don't get in a fight by accident. Who threw a pee pee up in the garbage? You're wasting good meds. Alright, let's go back to the rest house. Oh, too bad you don't have a PC in here. Can I get to your TV? TVs are pretty smart nowadays. La 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 la. I hear a sound from somewhere. Sometimes it sounds sad. Sometimes it sounds a little goofy. Do you think it could be a ghost? What? 
A girl practicing music in that house? I see. I got it. Thank you. Accept these as a thank you gift. Citrus berries, okay. Keep somebody's secret. Otherwise, your secret will be out. There wasn't anything else around here other than another trainer, was there? Practice as if it were a real game. Playing a real game as if it were a practice. Alright, see ya. This is Route 11, isn't it? As its name suggests, Village Bridge is a bridge with a village on it. That's right. No matter what anyone else says, that's what I think it is. Well, what else is anyone gonna call it? The dark musicians of Village Bridge aren't too bad. What do you mean by dark musicians? Oh, great, Route 11. I remember this one having a lot to it. I'm proud of my Pokemon, which I raised with love and care. Oh, did you now? Well, that's right, I gotta face you every time I get through here, too. Great. Are you starting off with an Emolga? Well, at least Spark is neutral. Now, it looks like Emolgas usually offer pretty good experience on their own. Altaria? I know you're not the best for the job, Goofy, but I would like that extra money. Maybe this breeder is loaded. I guess I got a crit out of it. Oh, damn it. Are you serious? I almost had it right there. Looks like I lost you in the love and care department. You're amazing. Okay, if you have the little amulet coin, you get over 2,600 coins. Yahoo! There's an awful lot of nothing around here, isn't there? A favored male. I like that there's nothing, but it's your heart's share. You should share, otherwise you're a greedy arse. I trained my body and mind by standing under a waterfall. Nothing will faze me now. Would it be alright if you went back to the waterfall and stayed there? Alright, Temple. Pretty sure Temple was still just water at, at the time. And Palpatode was park ground. That much I do remember. So we gotta switch out. I have a couple tumors on my head, that's why I look so hideous. What? I mean, how? Because you didn't waterboard yourself long enough. I admit your strength to give you this gift. An Aspear Berry? Maybe I should train my body and mind by standing under a waterfall. I can get clean while I'm at it. But what if the water is dirty? Then what? Oh, come on, Yancey! You just called me earlier this episode. The hell do you want now? Why am I telling her this? How is she getting this intel? Why does she feel like she has to tell me that she knows? Oh, great. Verizion. Kikla? I can fight you now? I don't think there's any reason for me to do that. Oh my god, I can get to Opelucid City immediately. Oh, hey, Iris. 
Yahoo! I haven't seen you since I ran into you in Castelia City. Are you here to battle Grandpa? Yep! Opelousa's City's gym leader, Trayden, is my Grandpa. We're not really related, though. Oh, the gym is that way. Before challenging it, you might want to go to Route 9. Still, your Pokémon really respect you. I feel how much fun your Pokémon are having, even from inside their Pokéballs. Good luck! Okay, there's the Pokémon Center. And that's a relief, because I like, really do need to get... I really do need to get Migraine out. That'll be a great help. Alright, so I guess against my better judgment... Before I end the episode... Well, I would like to check out Route 9, but first... I did say before this, so let's take on Cobalion. Not Cobalion, Verizion. This one is grass and fighting, if I remember. Uh, do I still have quick balls? I have one. No, screw it, let's go for it. Ah, uh, I wanted to believe that it would work. Alright, I got a new strat. I'm just gonna keep using Spark over and over until- Yeah, there we go, it's paralyzed. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Okay, I'm gonna bring in teeth. And hopefully I'll still be alive to be able to keep false swiping. Okay, this will work. You did your job. Now it's time for the Ultra Balls to do theirs. This is fine. This is fine. Too bad I don't have anything to just lower its attack. I would have to put Tony back in the, the computer. That would have helped. Giga Drain. Oh, shit. This adds a wrench to the plan. I am gonna have to screech you all the way down, aren't I? If you're capable of just going and, uh, doing that, using Giga Drain, that means I can't just rely on whittling it down. That has a, has a layer of complexity to it. Giga Drain also has 10 PP, so we'll be there a while. It's 
It's also smart enough to use Sacred Sword when it knows it can do a lot of damage. Oh, I thought I would have had it so soon. How the hell am I still in it? This is a problem. Should I have just gone for False Swipe again? Nope! I hate... I made the right play. Let's just say this Pokemon confounded opponents with its swift movements. It's the Grassland Pokemon. Got a good name for you. Just hope it'll be allowed. Grr ass. <laughs> Brilliant. It works. Full heal for my troubles, for which there were many. Why did that spot go away? That's rude. I didn't say you could go. I didn't get in a fight. I thought it only goes away when you leave the area or get in a fight. Huh, shows how much I know. Okay, let's heal up, and before we end the episode, let's see what's at Route 9. Like, why would Iris want me to go there first? Well, not like I have to go there first, but... She, for some reason, would rather I go to Route 9 than go see her unrelated grandpa. Why that first? Maybe just in case I can't beat him? Is that it? I remember about two years ago now. I heard that a guy with the legendary Pokemon Reshiram visited Opelucid City. Chew quietly. Oh. Shaking spot immediately. Ooh, level 39, Audino. This'll be great. If they're around this level, oh my. The first one! Like, I guess I can hang around here and try to power level a little bit more if I need to. And I should see what Pokemon are in this general area. Oh, all of Route 11 has the water Pokemon. Okay, that's not too bad. Route 9 has these. Cool. Let's just get into at least one wild Pokemon battle. Duosion? I already got a Solosis, so it's not that important. We'll just have to be taken down a peg. That's how it be. Alright, well, I tried. So let's just stop it here, and then in the next part we'll head back to Opelucid City and get started on the next gym. See everyone, thanks for watching.